Rob Perillo joining us in the Weather Lab tonight with more on the historical significance of Hurricane Laura. Rob. Yeah, it was in one of the top storms of all time in Louisiana history, but uh, looking back at the surge and maybe the surge not as bad, but we're not going to minimize the amount of water that came in with this system on the coast. But I think one of the saving graces and kind of rare for a hurricane in August around here is that it was moving along at a good clip. So perhaps it didn't build up the surge that we thought it was going to build up as it came inland, but nonetheless a devastating storm and the winds obviously one of the highest end events uh, wind wise, uh, at least going back to Hurricane Audrey, if not even uh, well back into the 1800s uh, with some of the big storms that uh, are on record then. Now it's relatively quiet. The storm continues to move generally off to the north and northeast is now finally downgraded to a tropical depression. The system uh, is uh, still producing some locally heavy rainfall off to the north, but in the near term, we're not done with the threat of locally heavy rains overnight tonight. Models suggesting showers and storms are going to get cooking by tomorrow morning, so it could be a little bit of a stormy start to the day and some locally heavy rainfall on saturated grounds, so we could see some localized street flooding as we go through late tonight, early tomorrow morning, but it looks like by afternoon things will be calming down just a little bit, but we have for the day about an 80% chance of showers and storms and your highest rain chances are going to come through the morning into the mid afternoon hours and then we think things tone down as we head into tomorrow evening. Temperatures topping out in the mid to upper 80s after a morning start and it's steamy out there. We still have that leftover humidity and we have that leftover moisture from Laura and we have a disturbance coming in. That's why we're going to see those high rain chances. More details on that and a long look at Marco and Laura and the rainfall output that we see coming out from this model coming up in just a bit.